Hello MechWarriors, how's it going? And welcome to another episode of MechWarrior Online, where we are playing the Hunchback. You can see we are running the laser Hunchback, the good old 4P. And yeah, we are going in with a nice classic build, because that thing can run a lot of medium lasers, and that's exactly what we're going to be doing. So, before we get into the build statistics and all of that, I want to quickly show you one thing, and that is this one here in the bottom. IS Medium Laser HSL, which means uh, we can fire two additional medium lasers without running into ghost which brings us to a total of eight, which means we're gonna use six here on the right side, torso, one on the head, one on the arm, that brings us to eight, and then the left arm is filled with a large laser. This way we are not running into ghost heat, we can fire all of the weapons at the same time, we have a 49 point alpha strike with that, and we even have a little bit of extra range on the large laser. But other than that, we should really try to get into the 300 meters range where our medium lasers perform in an optimal way, and then we're gonna shoot the crap out of our enemies. We're running a light engine 225, which brings us to 72 point nine kph i would say for a medium mech like that that's just enough and we even have enough room for an ams and the rest as you can see is just heat management 17 double heat sinks keep our mech somewhat cold and yeah if if you're running into any big heat problems take out the large laser out of the rotation and just use the medium lasers and you should be fine in terms Sorry, in terms of skills, we have firepower, obviously, and we wanted the laser vomit firepower tree to get the laser duration notes as well as a bit of heat gen, as well as a bit of cooldown, and of course, as well as a bit of range. That's just, it's just a very efficient way to get down to the yellow notes and get some value from, from cooldown and heat management. We also go for a left side of the survivability tree, getting extra armor hardening, and that's mostly because, and here's the thing, our right side torso, our right shoulder, has a crazy amount of armor for a 50-ton mech. And that will be amplified by all of these armor-hardening nodes. But it's also a pretty big hitbox, so it's an obvious target for your enemies to go to. And you should really try to not lose that rack, because if you lose it, your arm will also fall off. And you have one laser on the head, a medium, and then a large laser on the left arm. It's not much that you have left then. Also, if the right side torso, uh, sorry, if the left side torso pops, you will lose a lot of heat management. So it's kind of a do-or-die situation anyway. But yeah, that's kind of it. Let me go back to the skills here, because we are not done yet. One very important thing is cool run. Maximize that as one of your first priorities, and also get heat containment so that you can shoot more often. We also have radar deprivation, we have 60% of it, two cool shots, obviously, and a UAV. And that's the build, everybody. I wish you all a lot of fun in the two games that are coming now, and if you have that, then don't forget to leave a rating, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and now it's time to hit the battlefield. Alright, first game of the day. We are playing <laughs> the Robolite Oasis. It's quite hot here. Look at that we are building up 50% heat but we also have a decent heat dissipation so eh, yeah, it's, it's not gonna be really good but maybe we can just leave out the large laser and uh, just shoot the mediums when we are in a good close range scenario now we're gonna go to the high ground and I want to see if I can shoot somebody with my large laser at about 500 meters when we are here on the high ground and um, I don't think we can though now enemies will be at like 800 thousand meters away uh, the moment we are here and I think uh, getting getting closer means that we have to go more to the left side here, which I'm kind of doing right now and my people are following Hey, we dealt some damage. It's not much and we dodged the peep. All right, cool What else is coming? I mean since we know that they have PPCs It's probably a good idea to just stay out of the thick of it. <laughs> we can tickle all our enemies though and not deal any damage because of the limited range of the laser But that's okay because we are a close range or let's say mid-range fighter Let's go and shoot those guys. Now we deal damage again. We got our protected medium. We got our lance information bonus. And we also got an assist now, which is great. And another one. So, shall we just hold left side, guys? Just holding Echo 4. Yeah, you know, left side, right side, some side here. This is 500 meters. Oh, sorry, mister. I thought I could uh, push behind you. I don't want to get in your uh, line of fire there. I don't want to get on your angle. Somebody is calling assistance in Foxtrot 4, though? Why? Alright, that's bad. Ooh, that's everybody. Yeah, sure. I'm not gonna... I'm gonna not go in there. That's what I'm not gonna do. Okay, let's... Um, let's poke around here again. Nobody in the low ground. That's... In general, it's it's good. And we are, we are holding this here, big time. But our enemies are making kind of a push for it now. So let's let's go back to the left side. We have an annihilator who is hopefully holding this here with us. So yeah, going in, trying to get some damage. Oh, there's a there's a black knight. Hello, black knight. You also have some lasers, I see. Ah, uh, shoot him again. Shoot him again. 
or those guys there in general. Oh boy. I so now we're gonna go back because we really took way too much damage already. Or are we? I mean, there is a black knight down there who is about to die, and we are getting cold again. So that's good. Haha, <laughs> hey, Mr. Knight. Should probably not shoot my large here, right? Nah, that's okay. So, cooling down. It's important now. Oh boy, and uh, cover is also pretty important. That was dumb. That was wasted heat. That was not good. Uh, and that's everybody? Mm hmm. Everybody's in the low ground. Right. Seems like we are actually obliterating those guys, but I have the feeling that I'm not fighting at optimal range at all, ever. What about you, huh? 600 meters. This is not great, guys. This is the opposite of being great. And we are getting uh, mildly, mildly pushed. 400 is shootable. Yeah, let's get some damage on those dudes. Yeah, 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 it's fine. Leave me. So, all of our enemies are on the low ground now. If you want to get somewhere and if you want to get something done, we have to drop. All right, let's do it. Woo! Hi, friends. Haha, <laughs> you are an LP20. Please don't kill me. Yeah, it's okay. Blocked. Not anymore. So that's good. And we're gonna try to find an angle on the other side of the battlefield. Sure. The Thanatos spot, guys. There is a Thanatos. He is not aware. He is MRM 40, double 40. Lee probably, yeah, seen us. Hey, that's my friend from earlier. That's the Mad Cat. He should be so damaged though. He lost all of his weapons. Mad Cat is a stick. Ignore hotel, please. Ignore hotel. Don't waste heat on him. He doesn't have weapons. Uh, enemies know that we are here anyway, so uh, let's find them. Let's find them. Let's find them. Where the hell are they? That's the Thanatos. Yeah, and we have a nice laser burn in, in his back there. Cool shot. That fight is gonna last for a while. Oh, that's from above. Ooh, uh, who's that cat? We'll definitely go for the Thanatos first. Trying to avoid the return fire. Hey, little one. <laughs> is he going for me? He is completely going for me. I'm going to go for him, though. Look at his legs. Ow. That's bad. My left side also is kind of... It's a, it's a, ah, I got tricked. I got tricked hard. Get his legs, guys! Oh, shit, man. Oh. I lost my side also as a result big heat spike, as a result shutdown, as a result... Ow. Now we are the ones herded down here in the low ground. <laughs> All right, back to action. It's still... It's funny that the Mad Cat is still alive with his one laser AMS. Oh, man. The heat buildup is now way too hot. All right, here we are again. Nine and eight. Uh-oh. That's machine guns, dudes. Really? Stop it. Leave me. And that's it. I died from overheating, but there was nothing else I could have done here. Nothing at all. I was so pushed. <laughs> yeah, 11 and 10. One more enemy alive. Let's see. Maybe we can, uh, maybe we can win this still. Um, sure. Let's take a look around. Oh my god. Ah, uh, learn some PPCs with uh, advanced zoom. All right, Timberwolf there. One more enemy on the high ground. We have large pulses and mediums on the grasshopper. This grasshopper seems pretty fresh still. So he should be able to get things done. That was the guy. Light machine guns and uh, no PPCs anymore because now he's basically dead. But he was freaking me out a little bit. I thought I had some light mechs. I had a light mech on my tail though. And I thought it was the light mech harassing me. This Vapor Eagle had no real power. Huh. Let's see. What's going on here? Come on, he's right behind you. Wouldn't you not like to kill him? Get him! Shoot him at the peeps! Alright. New player? Who knows? <laughs> anyway, we got him. Uh, uh, 280? 275, I think? I don't know. 
So, let's take a look at the end score here. I tried my best. We died, but we got 8 assists, 1 kill, most damage dealt, uh, 600, uh, 577 done, 426 taken, and 5... No, 1 component destroyed. That was the first round. Let's go over to the next one and see how this will go down. All right, a second game of the day. We are playing Terra Therma, and uh, that's obviously not the best map for our build. Hey, let's see what we can do. We are playing Conquest here, and we are... Moving more or less to the left side, which I appreciate because right side is kind of a trap. It's kind of a bad thing to do because there is a huge, huge choke point that you have to go through. And uh, while you're trying to get just out of that thing into the next open space, you are getting shot by all of the enemies who are sitting up in the center of the map. So let's go to the left side. It's kind of better, I believe. Anyway, um, yeah, we need to get into 300 meters range in order to get things done here. We have our AMS ready. We have a large laser ready, but... Um I have the feeling that uh, this is going to be a very tough fight here for us in general. We have to engage early in order to deal uh, solid damage and we have to engage often, which means uh, I have to take some risks in order to uh, be helpful for the team. Because if I, if I wait for my time and only come in very late, I can only shoot two alpha strikes and then the game will be over. So again, engaging early is my, my goal, but this spot is covered by enemies. I'm not going to go there. We're going to try to go around Golf 8 following this arctic wolf here and i hope that the kodiak is also coming with us here noise it's a kodiak 3 that is helping out hopefully wait you're not going back oh come on guys really <sighs> hey look at that i saw an enemy on the map let's go there right now hi aki cheetah we can kill cheetah we can do that okay got him okay cheetah down and I would say uh, we're gonna continue our stride here. Enemies are on the center, I guess. Well, let's see what we can do on the left side here. Thanks for the help, by the way. That was really nice to have. Next up. Oh, that's kind of everybody. Okay. Can we dive down? Can we disengage? We have everybody in Golf 8, guys. We need help right now. Um, Like every everybody. Like every every everybody. <laughs> Holy crap. Uh, they are shooting down my UAV. That's good. Uh, I mean, we have some people here. Wow. And we were able to actually survive this. That's crazy, guys. Okay. Good. Got the UAV. Uh, now we're gonna give the quick draw hell. That's the opposite of what we had. What? You see? Wow. That's a kill, man. <laughs> All right. Let's go for Mr. Foxy. Mr. Kid Foxy. Ah, oh, man. I wonder if I should go for my Mr. Cool Shot already. Yeah, I will. That's an LB20. Ah, that's a Brawling Highlander. Gotta be careful, though, because everybody's coming in now. I mean, I was calling for help, and now they're here. However, it makes us very clumped up. And makes us uh, maybe shoot our friends. So, uh, let's take a look around. We're gonna watch this. Mm, that's what I mean. People are super eager to fight here. But hey, we got some damage in. Enemies are now behind us? Really? Get the leg off the crab. Come on, pin him down. Hey, it's I got yeah, it is the Barra dude. It's also a Kid Fox. I'm just trying to shoot my medium lasers mostly here. Oh, enemies are going in our backs. I may have made a mistake here. Let's go for, for everything. Alpha striking like a boss. Where's the Fox? Kid Fox is still alive. I think, yeah, there wasn't a, a kill indicator. He is desperately trying to get into a spot with his team again. And yeah, we have a Orion with us. That's good. All right, let's go for normal vision again. And we are mildly, mildly dying here. Ooh, that's not good. We need to get a squishy target. Somebody that we can actually kill. Kid Fox is coming back. He is damaged on the legs, though. He was pushing through. All right, got him. Uh, pulling back, pulling back, pulling back. I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck. I'm, I'm panicking. I'm stuck panicking. All right, heat vision for better hit registration. Better, better vision here. Gotta get out of this. This is not my fight. Oh, uh, maybe it is though. But I need to get a better angle. Not being so close. Oh, no, not for me. No. Yeah, that's, uh, I'm almost dead. <laughs> <laughs> That's not so good. And there's the counter push. All right. Although I wonder why they are doing it. Um, Marauder is certainly killable. Holy... I was not overridden. I'm, I'm not here. All right, five and five. 
I mean, we are cooling down again. And the Marauder is now open. Marauder is open, guys. Foxtrot is open. Get that center torso down. What a side torso. That's good. Yeah, that helps. Going for it. Going all in. Touching my, my heat threshold. Seven and six. We are missing the caps big time. All right. I'm going to do one thing now. I'm going to turn around. And I'm going to go to Gamma. I have to. If we want to win this game, this is not decided by the fight. Or is it? Maybe it is. Let's go for his leg. Cool. Man, seven and nine. We have to. We have to win the fight first. If we are not winning the fight, we have nothing. I mean, I took some time to... To cool down. But can we do it? I don't know. Uh, there's a stealth mech right next to me. Okay. Where is he? Left there he is. Oh, um, that's my, that's my torso. And that's my kill. Nice try, dude. Nice try, yeah. I was, I was not able to do anything anymore. My side torso was blown up. My heat dissipation, bam, went down. My heat spike, bam, went up. I was so overheating that that was the desperate attempt to get another kill done. But yeah, guys, we got five killing blows, five assists, three kill most damage dealt, 900 damage done. If it wasn't for the caps, Oh man, we could have won this year. I mean, it was it was over anyway. But anyway, that was a good fight here. I really enjoyed it. And that on Terra Therma. Holy crap, in a laser hunchback. Yeah, guys, that was it for today. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, then don't forget to leave a rating. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I hope to see you on the battlefield. Goodbye.